love YouTube. I'm going to school actually. It's 6 in the morning. And I've got my super bright daylight savings light right here just so that I don't look yellow. So right now I basically just have a moisturizer on and a primer on my face. And I won't be doing any of my eyes for this tutorial due to the fact that because there is no mascara that will compare to my YSL Fossil, Fossil, whatever you call it. You know, I really do think it's best for me to do videos early in the morning because everybody's asleep and I'm wide awake. So usually when I wake up in the morning, I stumble out of bed, make my way in a dark like a bat, and then I do sit-ups. I've been trying to do sit-ups, trying to be working on my abs, you know. Um, gotta work on these abdomens. Woo! Okay. So on my lighter days for school, my lighter days, oh, that sounds like a Mr. Rouse cycle. Um, on my lighter days for school, I try to keep it natural pretty much because that's usually when I like to go jogging around my neighborhood. I'm usually one of those people that like to go jogging around my neighborhood. <laughs> Neighbors, you all suck. But if I'm going to school, I got to keep my face as natural as possible. You just really don't want to go to school looking like, you know, 10 trannies just slapped you across the face. So all of the high-end makeup that I would normally use in the morning, they're out of the question. But I've been trying to wear my makeup as natural as possible. I have discovered, well, you know, I'm a late boomer, so I've recently just discovered this a month ago. But it is, is it Maybelline? Maybelline? Yes, it is Maybelline. It is their Super Stay Makeup, the 20, oh is it the 20, yes, yes, oh perfect. It is the 24 hour Super Stay Makeup and let me tell you, this is just as good, this is what I believe. This is what I believe, right? So don't go against what I believe. Um, this is kind of like comparable to the Revlon Usually this hand motion makes me think, oh, it's usually uh, the Revlon uh, Color Stay that I can compare this to the best kind. It says it withstands heat, sweat, and humidity. And if you live in Southern California, all those weather combined all in one day. And the thing that really impressed me about this foundation is not only it's uh, uh, medium to buildable coverage, but it also is non-transfer. Won't rub off, you know? Now I know, ladies, when you go hugging your man and he's wearing a white t-shirt and you like, you know, plop your face on his shoulders and then you've realized you've left an imprint the size of Texas onto his shoulders and then he'll realize, you know, later on in a day, and then they'll ask you, uh, babe, what is this? That is when you play the innocent car. You just tell them, uh -huh. I don't know, did you wipe yourself good in the bathroom today? The one thing I liked about this is that it's oil free and it's non-clogging of the pore. Um, you know, I think it's bad enough that some of us have hair on our bellies, but when hair decides to join the party onto your nose, you know, with the little blackheads and stuff, and then the pores around it, surrounding it, like, you know, some huge crater, like some meteorite just landed on your face, that's my friend will take care of it. In case you're wondering, I am in the shade True Beige. True Beige. Okay, so since I told you I already have a moisturizer and primer on, I am just gonna open this and gonna pour it. Oh, not too much. You know, just a little pea size is enough. The brush that I'll be using today is my Sigma Flat Top Kabuki F80 brush. We're just gonna stipple this on. Blah, 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 blah. And we're just going to tap, tap, tap this all over your face. Okay. So then again, my skin has been really good this month. I haven't really had any, you know, probably that really nice coverage. And like I said, I don't really have much to cover up, but maybe the dark circles right here, the big pores right here, you know, that's pretty much it. This foundation is very inexpensive. I think it's, it was only like... I can't point out how much it is. Mistake, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but I think it's between seven to eleven dollars. I know that's a big gap, but I really don't know. Just to be safe, take it from me. You should start saving your money now. You know, put it in your IRA, put it in a retirement fund. Because let me tell you something. By the time you're sixty, ooh, you would be a rolling, rolling grandma. Trust me, when you get older, you'll need that money. All right, if you want to be a rolling grandma, save your money now, grandma. 
rolling in my hundred thousand Escalade. My granny bad, my granny hoot. My granny do stuff that your granny wish she could. She can limbo, she can do karate. She'll take your man, put him in the van, slap him and bam, bam, bam. Boy, you wish you were my man. Ugh. All right, that's enough. So the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to grab my Maybelline Matte Dream Matte Powder. If you don't have this powder, it is one of the best. One of the best powders drugstore will ever offer you. So I just like to put this on my T-zone, mostly where I get oily, my T-zone. And somewhere on my cheeks and stuff, I just put it everywhere. Yeah, I'm just gonna put it everywhere, so. I'm just gonna lock in the oil that secretes from my facial structure. Okay, and then I'm gonna add a little bit of color on my face. So I'm going to use this Sonia Kashuk. I don't know. The name came off, sorry. But it just looks like this. It's a it's a powder blush and it's really really peachy color. Like that. That's what it looks like. And I'm gonna grab my Sigma Large Angled Contour Brush F40. Just gonna dibby dab a little. And remember, we're going for the natural look, so you don't want to look too overdone, okay? Especially if I'm going to go jogging after class. Mm -mm. You don't want to look too overdone when you're jogging because, you know, some man might snatch you up and then you'll end up in the news. And then people will look at you like, ha <laughs> don't blame him. Okay, so I'm just going to put this slightly on my cheeks, just like that. And that concludes my foundation, more of the natural makeup. Uh, the last thing I'm going to do is put on my NYX lipstick, and this is in T Rose, and it looks like this. Ooh, it looks scary, but not really. And so I'm just gonna pat this onto my lips, just like that, and I'm just gonna blend it out with my fingers. Okay, so then you'll just have that naturally rosy lips. Ooh, I look dark, don't I? I'm wearing this neon sports bra because I will be going jogging. Okay, so that is my natural makeup look using Maybelline Superstay 24 Hour Foundation. And as Ben Affleck says, I'll see you on this side or the other. Bye.